Rules by Andrew Buckle. In this tutorial I'm just going to show you quickly how to create a sort of smoke like effect in Painter. Now with Painter you've got a whole range of different selection of brushes and the latest version has got this new particles feature so the key thing to actually create a smoke effect is spring particles and I've actually just created this one already I've just created this category obviously any category you can actually just save a variant so uh, save a variant now just go over here to spring key thing for here is general and single and spring particles obviously it's a whole range of other ones but spring particles there set the option to nucleus that's a key thing pass opacity set over to maximum spring you don't want to see all the lines so it's, but you want to see some so set it to about 24 percent stiffness you want to have it sort of a fairly nice structure for the smoke set it to 100% and all the other various ones just set down to jitter and chaos you just want to minimize those a little bit of damping you want to set the force because that gives a sort of nice line to the, the smoke which looks quite effective with the smoke as well as you can obviously modify direction as well okay so once you've actually done that you can actually just go over and just quickly add the smoke just very subtle and the, also another key thing is the opacity just set it to a fairly low value so don't obviously don't have to set it high you can actually set it maybe 20 percent and a reasonable size you can vary the size you don't have to so you can just just apply it once or twice just add smoke effect and just brush it down there and again like i say probably maybe less opacity perhaps right so that's <clears throat> that's the basic settings for creating a sort of very small it's actually a pity that uh, with the these particle brushes that there's actually um, for all the vast range of things it'd be nice to actually there's not actually one that particularly creates what I think is a totally convincing smoke but uh, I think this one's these settings possibly maybe make it slightly more like a sort of smoky effect I'm certain other people will come forward with uh, their own uh, settings for painter 2015 for smoke effects but this is certainly I think works well works better actually outside of the tutorial because the actual makes it a lot slower to process so hope you found this quick run through of interest